Hey what is up guys, I am Meta and welcome back to Undertale and this will be episode 3. If you guys did enjoy the last episode then go back and hit a like button on that if you have not already and if you guys are ready for more Undertale and much more to come then go ahead and support this video and all those future episodes to come. If you guys are excited as I am, let's get right back into this. So in the last episode we got out of the ruins while having to be so merciful to Toru and we went through a couple of jokes, there's a couple of, a couple of funny bones I should say. You <laughs> I cracked myself up. Holy body bag. So as I was saying about undying. <laughs> Sans, oh my god, is that a human? Oh. Actually, I think that's a rock. <laughs> I hate sand. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! I'm dying well. I've gotta... I'll be so popular, popular, popular! Ahem. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. Nyak, 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 Well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Yo, Sans, I love your puns, dude. Oh my gosh, this man is a beast. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observed the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. Note, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Alright. Alright. Absolutely no moving. Oh, I'm moving, I'm moving. What are you going to do about that? I'm <laughs> Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human. I'll uh, make sure it never moves again. A doggo. Doggo blocks the way. They actually call it doggos. Holy crap. Doggo. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Uh, moving, moving. Doggo is confirming the moving object. Oh no. So don't move. It moved. It didn't. It did not move. Doggo can't seem to find anything. That's just a radar. You pet doggo. What? I've been pet. Pet, 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 pot, pot, pet, pet, pot. Doggo has been pet. Uh, okay. Yo, I'm already loving the game mechanics in this. S -s -s Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Hello? Is anybody there? No? What happens if we keep talking to this guy? Are you two playing a trick on me? Real funny. Big guy? Is that you? Come on. Are we gonna, we gonna get anything from this? Or is it just like, well, he's not the tallest skeleton. He's too loud. Whoever you are, knock it off! Is this gonna go anywhere? I wanna see if it goes somewhere. Hey, it's my boy Sans. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Blue stop signs. Alright, I see you. <laughs> North ice, west ice, south ice, east Snowden Town, and ice. <laughs> I like the humor in this game. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you'd be so kind, traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. 
I mean, I I'll take it far away, but that's not really you going there, man. But you know what? If it makes you feel better. You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses. Excuses. Oh, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. Well, you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. What is that? <laughs> Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Look at this dude. Hold this, please. Look at this jokester. Oh my gosh. Okay, try now. Look at this dude. He literally just had the path drawn out for me. <laughs> hey, Papyrus, I'll take it though. I'll take it. It's incredible. You slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle would not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. Nyak, 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 nyak. Saw that boy slide out real quick. He went zoom on a new. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? See, it's nice to see that they don't just think each other are idiots, but they actually like each other. Just a rock? I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. It's actually not. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's a frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15G. Hey, I'll buy some. Here you go. Have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. I want to buy some more. I'm buying some more because I know I'm going to need that health. I got 87G, 72, space, 5 out of 8. Boy, I'm going to buy more nice cream. I know I'm going to need that health because you all know. If you watch my show on ILP, you know how much I love health. I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just 5G. Did I say 5G? I meant 50G. Really? How about 5,000G? I had to pay for the raw material somehow. Alright, Sans. More of these guys. His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. A suspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating, smell of rolling around, weird smell, humans, green rating, destroy at all costs. I mean, uh, okay, all right. It's a little bit more. Uh, hey, there we go. Whew. Got ourselves a flag, a hey, purple. Even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of ball. You are awarded 2G. Hey, I'll take that though. 2G, I'll take it. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. <laughs> I don't know what a decahedron is, but... Human, I hope you're ready for... Sans, where's that puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Uh... Sans, that didn't do anything. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Yeah, hey man, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Jumble or cross crosswords? You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy, it's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Nyuck, nyuck, nyuck. <laughs> These two. Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday, he got stumps trying to, stall, trying to solve the horoscope. First, I thought I actually had to do something with that. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. 
Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly gypped again by the great papyrus. Nyuck, nyuck, nyuck. Papyrus. All right, papyrus. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Let's save up here. Mouse still chilling? It's, it's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold. It's stuck to the table. Hey, 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 let's heat this bad boy up real quick. It's an unplugged microwave. All the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> There's literally a microwave for spaghetti, but it's in the middle. Can't be plugged in, and it's so cold it's stuck to the table. All right, Papyrus. Warning, dog marriage. Uh, 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 okay. Ice cap beers. Jerry came too. What? I'm gonna ignore the ice cap. Manage to tear your eyes away from ice cap's hat. It looks annoying. Cause I'm not about to play these games with you, Ice Cap. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Fine, I don't care. <laughs> I'm thinking, guys. Okay, I didn't mean to get by that. Spare the Ice Cap. So, like, what are you even doing? Because everyone has to go to the bathroom. Ditch. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. You won. Uh. Hey, get out of the way, Snow. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Move, 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 move. It's a map. So is it just the middle of those two things right there? There's a switch hidden in snow. Click. See, look at that. We puzzle solvers out here, boy. Easy. Oh, papyrus. Oh. Not papyrus. Help. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Hey, they're looking. They ain't gonna find me. Hmm, here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Doggy assaults you. Doggambi and Dogarissa. Pet, the dogs are too suspicious of your smell. Paws off, you smelly human. That's not your husband, okay? Yeah, you don't even got to move, man. The dogs are saying sickly sweet things to each other. Alrighty then. The dogs sniff you again, but you smell just as weird as before. Mm, what's that smell? Smell mystery. Roll around. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Don't touch my dog. He means me. Don't touch my hot dog. He means me. So I actually still have to move with these things. It would be nice to know that I couldn't avoid those before. See, this is why I bought those nice creams, man. Let me just not move. Yeah, I, I, was, I tried to move down, but I actually moved the other way. We sniff. The dog sniff you again. After you rolling in the dirt, you smell all right. Oh, I'm a... <laughs> I should have did that after. I should have... Oh, I didn't think of that. At first, I thought I was sniffing them. For some stupid reason, I thought I was sniffing them. But no, it was to get them to smell me. You're rolling in the dirt, you smell all right. What? It smells like a... Are you actually a little puppy? Yeah, I should have moved. Dogs think that you may be a lost puppy. The dogs already know you smell fine. What? So I get this one if I get smelled by a dog Erisa. You pet dog on me. Wow, pet by another pup. Well, don't leave me out. Ooh. I mean, not get by those dogs since you may be a lost puppy. But now I have to pet Dogaressa. Pet the Dogaressa. A dog that pets dogs. Amazing. What about me? Oh, The dog's minds have been expanded. Woo! That was, uh. That was something. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. 
Thanks, weird puppy. Okay, I guess. I mean, they warned me dog marriage was a thing. Hey, my boy Papyrus, what you doing over there? Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. Okay, that's fine. I'm fine with that. Click. I'm fine with these little puzzles. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? Oh, what did you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Left it. Really? Wow, we you resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta just so you could share it with me? Right not human. I am Master Chef Papyrus will make you all the pasta you could ever want. Hehehehe <laughs> I mean, I, 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 hey, I, I like pasta. I'll take that if you want it. If you want me to have it. My brother started a stock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> uh, I sometimes feel like they both don't know what's happening. Human. Mm, how do I say this? You are taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Dang it, I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. So what do I have to stop then? Here you go, I figured out the puzzle. You seem like you're having fun though. Do you absolutely, absolutely want the solution? Absolutely, absolutely want the solution? Yes. The solution is, please imagine a drum roll in your head. That tree over there has a switch on it. Check it out. I hate this man so much. Oh my gosh. There's a switch on the trunk of this tree. Press it. Yo. I hate this dude. I hate him. I hate him. Hold on, let me flip that one. Use the last puzzle to your advantage. So I will do go like that. And then next, I could do. Dang it! I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Alright, I got this. I got this. I got this. I didn't, mean to, I didn't mean to hit that one. Let's go like this. Hit that one. Hit that one. But I know y'all see what I'm talking about, right? You, see, you know what I'm talking about. Just go boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. boom. Easy, look at that. See, it doesn't mean press this switch. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, that took way too long. I mean, it didn't take too long, but they tried to trick me with that switch on the tree. Hey, why didn't you ask for help? I was right here. Boy, you are right nowhere. Don't give me that. Boy, if you don't. Hey, it's the human. I gotta love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tile. They did not do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Understand the explanation? Of course. Alright, and there's one last thing. <laughs> this puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, 
You will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I want all the solution. <laughs> Get ready. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Alright, let's see what we get. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yo. That couldn't have been any more perfect. Holy crap. Hey, he said it was completely randomized. He wanted a whole big explanation to make us worried. He said it could be randomized. He said nothing wrong with pink tiles. Red tiles are impossible. Oh my gosh. Just as soon as it, it was randomizing, then as soon as it stopped, and they just looked and then he just spun out of the room. Oh my gosh. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad for my brother since he started a cookie lesson. He's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. Oh my gosh, that was hilarious. Oh my gosh. This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. On the floor inside is a box of palm raisins. Aware of dog, please pet dog. Who's this? That dog considers itself an artist, but doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that his brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Oh my gosh, that was hilarious. Oh, I got a kick out of that. That was perfect even after that puzzle. I took way too long. I went, oh my gosh, that was hilarious. I love Papyrus and Sans already. Knowing that dog would never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. Snowden Doghouse. So, I think this is as good a spot as any to win this episode. So, if you guys did enjoy this episode, if you got a kick out of it, you got a kick out of Sands of Papyrus if you, if you enjoyed the commentary. If you overall enjoyed this episode and you're enjoying this LP and can't wait to see the episodes in the future, my reactions and stuff, how I like it and everything like that, then stick around because it's definitely going to be a wild ride. So once again, thank you for watching. I thank every single one of you that support me on this channel because it really helps out a ton. And all you future viewers and new viewers, hi, I'm Meta. I do gameplay videos, anime discussion videos, or pretty much I record and upload anything that I want or the, that I'm feeling at that time. So, yeah, I hope you all stick around for the wild ride because we're on this journey together. So, thank you all for watching. Once again, this is Meta, signing out. Peace out, guys.